A has water and ammonia in ratio 1 is to 4. So water is 1 out of 1 plus 4 parts, that is 20%. And in case of B, water is 3 out of 3 plus 1 parts, which is 75%. The question is asking when these two are mixed, what is the ratio of water and ammonia in the resultant solution? So, solution A and B are mixed in the ratio 2 is to 3. So, if this is known, we know that out of A and B, A has 20% water, B has 75% water. They are mixed in ratio 2 is to 3. So, we can assume values as 200 and 300. Actually, it doesn't matter. 20% of 200 is 40 and 75% of 300, whatever that number is, you don't have to actually waste time in doing that. We know that what total amount of water in the solution mixed up would be 40 plus 225, 265 upon total quantity here, 500. Don't have to actually find out the exact value. What matters is that a unique answer is possible. So statement 1 alone gives me a unique answer. See, suppose I had not taken 100, if I had taken 2k and 3k, all these values would be in the form of k and eventually k would get cancelled and I will get a good percentage value. If I know the percentage value, I can find of course the ratio also. 53% water means the water and ammonia ratio is 53 to 47. So statement 1 is sufficient. Statement 2 alone says that this was 20 liters. A was 20 liters. It doesn't say anything about B and therefore statement 2 alone is not sufficient. The answer is option A.